Captain's Log, Stardate, the here and now. We've been sailing for quite a while and we've taken on water. I fear there will be more breaches in the hull soon. And worse yet, I just broke my steering wheel. Two shot! First officer, two shot! Two shot! Two shot! Two shot, get up! Two shot, you need to get up right now! We've what, got what's going on? The ship is sinking! A second? What happened? The ship is sinking, guy! We, we hit something! There's a breach in the hole! You're... Oh. Before we go, you have to leave your sponge behind, too. What? A sponge? I can't... We don't... We don't have time? We have no time! It's sinking! Leave your damn sponge here! Ugh. Alright, let's go. Alright, come on. Ah. Where's... Where's Officer Bradley? Officer Bradley... He died. He wanted you to have this. It was his leg. All right, now we gotta go. Hold on to Officer Bradley's leg. You never know when it'll come in handy. This may be the final time I get to say this. Goodbye, Henrik. What, you were a what, good friend. What are you doing? I'm, I'm saying no goodbye time, to Henrik. No time to save my sponge, but you're saying goodbye to Henrik? Henrik is special. He's a snow golem with a heart in a jar. We need to get out of here, though. This is, this is too chaotic. We're taking on too much water. This thing is going to sink. There's no controls. We're heading to an island. We got to get out of here quick. What happened to the wheel? Oh my god. I told you I broke it, didn't I? Oh, let's get the hell out of here. Here's the damn wheel. We got to get out of here. It's going to ah. crash. Jump. Oh, god, I got to get the fuck up to, to the air. Is that four star? Hey. Two shot. Yeah, I can see you. Oh, good, you made it. Thought we were oh. pretty screwed there. Cal. Okay. Oh, man, Henrik. You think Henrik's alright? I don't know. That was a pretty bad crash. <sighs> were you able to hold on to Officer Bradley's leg? Yes. It may come in handy. Now, um, I think I see a skull in that mountain up there. Oh, yeah, I see a lighthouse. To a right. lighthouse? Where? To the right. All right, well, I think we've got a place to go to. Let's try to make it over there, right? All right. You're, uh, you're intact. You're not hurt. I've still got melons. Lots okay. of melons, actually. Good. I got an extra lug if I need it. <laughs> All right. But, uh, yeah, I'm lucky that I had time to actually retrieve all the melons from our ship's cargo hold before the crash. And, uh, poor Squishy didn't make it. Yeah, well, uh, maybe he would have been able to make it, your precious sponge, but I was busy writing the fridge. So, let's, uh... Yeah, ran out of time, right? Yeah, let's look for... Alright, you want to go to the skull or the lighthouse? Skull, lighthouse, skull, lighthouse. Hmm. Well, the skull doesn't seem like a most inviting place. How about the lighthouse? Maybe there's civilization over there? Where yeah. You know what would have come in handy? During that storm. A lighthouse! That is true. <laughs> and it looks like it's never lit. It is daytime. Hey, look, we can dive! Alright. Oh. Yeah! That was perfect. A 10 from everyone but the Russian judge. I hate those <laughs> Russian judges. <laughs> uh, do, they, do they give 10s in diving? I don't even know. Do they have diving? No? Diving's an Olympic sport. Oh. Sorry. Jeez, too. Learn your. Hey, it's 2012, alright? Olympics are this year. So. I'm very you sorry. should know this. Yeah, London 2012 Olympics. 2010 Olympics kicked ass, though. So my home city. Canada won more gold medals than any other country ever. Just saying. Best time of my life. I was a gold medal Olympian. Gold medal fan, I should say. Uh, alright. There's a town over here. Oh, do you want to go to the lighthouse first or the town? Actually, we could use some uh, supplies, maybe a crafting bench. Let's go yeah. to the town. Oh, man. Oh, look, there's a sign. Where? Up over here. Oh, right here. Here we go. Read chapter two. Okie doke. Turns out you were the sole survivor of your ship's crew, aside from Foster the Canadian. The villagers speak a language unknown to you. 
And while they are friendly, they're of little use in finding out where you are or where to go from here. Lighthouse up on the bluff stands tall, but it's unlit. Oh, that makes sense. Perhaps there is something to be found there. Before you head to the lighthouse, however, the blacksmith offers you some tools of survival. All right, blacksmith, thank you. Where, where is this blacksmith? Is that him? Hey, buddy, give me your tools. I don't think oh. that's him. Oh, there's a nice little drop right here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, look at that. All right, so uh, look for the blacksmith. Oh, here it is. There, get... there we are. You found it? Yeah, it's the one with the lava, right? Oh, cool. There's no black... Oh, there's chest. Chest, chest, chest. Oh, we got some stuff here. Hey, I want stuff. Get away. There we go. Hey. Oh, God, a saddle? I don't know why the saddle's in there for... So th but there's I took a it saddle just in case. and leather chaps. Uh... <laughs> I don't know what this blacksmith is into, but I look fantastic in these chaps. All right, here we go. I, <laughs> d does this look all right? <laughs> look like you craft your pants. You know, it'll look like a fisherman <laughs> to me. Yeah, yeah. yeah. All right. How, all do right. I, how do I look? You kind of look like crap. Oh, you mean with the uh, the clothes on? Yeah, you look all right. Now we got some coal. Some. Do you want to cook this food, maybe? I have plenty of melons. You take that food if you want, but I've got no, melons. That's okay. We can make bread if we need to. Oh, I have an oh. idea. What idea? We got some iron. You said his leg would come in handy, right? Officer Bradley yeah. would be proud. Now we're wielding him as a sword. Ah, <sighs> one of the best officers on our ship. And now, our best weapon. Thank you, Officer Bradley. Thank you. We got some bread, too. <laughs> All right. All right, it's nighttime. Yep. I'm not getting in bed with you if that's what you're getting at. All right, no. do you want to go to the lighthouse? <laughs> All right, we'll come back for some of this food. I grabbed some of it. Again, I have plenty of melons. Full of melons, in fact. You're full of melons? Melons. Ay. What, what are you doing? I'm trying to find a way up and down. All These right. villagers are not the best builders. Nah, they're all right. They, they built a lighthouse that doesn't work. Aside from that, it's all right. It doesn't look like there's many people who live here, though. This is just a, a small town. Uh, there must be something going on. Hey, is that our ship, or...? Is that someone else's down there? In remnants of a ship, there's fire, a sail. Oh, that's much bigger than our ship. Huh. Is that uh, the one that we were supposed to be going to? Yeah, I think we were. Where we got blown off course? Yeah, we were supposed hmm. to salvage some And that's the there. story we're sticking to, right? Blown off course, not incompetent captain, right? No. R right? Not broken wheel. It's not my fault the wheel just comes off. How am mm. I supposed to know that? This oh. wasn't the best idea, I wasn't. <laughs> no, it wasn't. Oh, crap. Oh, wait a second. Here we go. Up here, too. Jump on this, and then over. No, just get on the... Uh... Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Never mind. Oh, wow. We were, I didn't we're know this was a parkour map. <laughs> oh, there's, uh, there's a way around. Hopefully we can get in, but... Oh. Hmm. Oh, here we go. This is the lighthouse keeper. I've got a question for you. Why did you turn the light off? Hmm? Maybe if you read chapter 3, they'll let you know. <sighs> Maybe. The lighthouse keeper is an old man who speaks English that you pelted repeatedly with a melon. He tells you that he himself wrecked the ship upon the sh shore around 40 years ago. Ever since he dedicated himself to a simple life of building this lighthouse and maintaining a vigil over these cliffs. Although he does a horrible job at it. <laughs> to make sure nobody else shared his fate, when you ask him why the lighthouse wasn't lit when you sailed towards the cliffs, he gets anxious and says he will not say anything unless you do him a favor. The villages nearby have been plagued by a pirate marauders of late. Their nearest hideout sits beneath the bridge between the town and the lighthouse. The lighthouse keeps, uh, keeper tells you that if you aid the village in clearing them out, he'll tell you all you want to know. Alright, so we gotta go, uh, 
to their hideout beneath the bridge that's uh, right over here. Sorry for pelting you with a melon. My bad. <laughs> oh. Alright, their hideout is beneath the bridge here. That thing was here for 40 years and it's still on fire. That's a strong ass fucking. No, no, that's the ship we were going to, not his ship. Oh, alright. Use the logic, man. Oh, what hey. the hell? You see that thing? I, what thing? Straight ahead. Oh, maybe he'll help us. Hello, sir? Sir, we just. Oh, God, sir! <laughs> what happened? I don't think he was going to help. He just. He exploded. Oh, Alright, oh. I, I see more of them. I see. Yeah, those are the pirates he's talking about, right? Uh, apparently. I should have known by the uh, the garb he had on. Alright, you have the sword. You have Bradley's sword. Go take him down. I'll, I'll keep lookout for any, I guess, any ships. <laughs> Alright, oh. so that... That spider just got hurt over there. Huh. Alright, if they drop anything, let me know. Because I could use a weapon. Melons aren't the most effective weapon. I'd like to make a cactus sword. If we have another stick, I can make you a That'd sword. Huh. Oh. oh. Watch back. Oh! God, thank you. That's just why. Oh! Ah, is this their hideout? Or is this uh, just another villager house? Yeah, this is a villager house. Alright, the hideout must be in that cave down there then. Oh god, I'm about to die. <clears throat> Here, have some melons. Oh yeah, I'm good. I'm good. Take a melon. Take my melon. Hmm. Wow. I you are just random I'm stuff on me now. I risked my life during the storm. I even risked your life in the storm by getting these melons first. And that's how you <laughs> repay me. All right. So, All right. you think this is a hideout or? It should be. Only one way to find out. Who? Do you want to call this one an episode? Already? And we'll check to make sure this is the hideout before we just wander somewhere where we shouldn't be. You know what? Yeah, that sounds good. I. <laughs> oh, I this is episode zombie. one. As I'm well, fighting my way through the cave, we have no. I guess torches. we'll find their hideout in the next episode. Then, Until next time. Two this shots. Is with and Officer Foster. Bradley's sword. Well, his leg as a sword. And Foster the Canadian. I did not wreck the ship. It was, uh, the winds. <laughs> Later, guys. <laughs>